So guys, um, I'm back, and I got what I need to use to make my hamster cage. That's why these are not open yet. So, I'm going to show you how to make one. So what you're going to need is an empty box of cheap chips. And either black... Um, <clears throat> black foam, or any color foam, or any color paint. Okay. So, yeah. So you're gonna open that up and take this thing out. And make sure there's no more heat tips in there. And if you want, you can keep this top part on for like when they go in to get the the little hamsters out. Or you can get scissors. This is what I'm doing. Cut this part that part off. Okay. Cut this little thingy off. And keep that open if you want. Or you can just cut the whole thing off. So, um. I don't know. Should I? Um, okay, I'm just going to cut mine off. Then you have something like that. Okay. So then you're gonna um take white paper or just like if you have a hamster and you have like those wood chips. Then you can use them, um, I don't have a hamster, so I'm just going to use paper to be the, um, wood chips. So just take paper and just rip it. It doesn't have to be, like, equal or anything, just rip it. Just like tear strips, and we'll just do that.
Okay. So I guess I'm okay. Then, we have the hamsters. I'm gonna open it. I'm just gonna use my stapler remover from this thing. It came right out. So my thingy looks like that. I'm gonna keep this little bag. Oh my god, they're so adorable! Okay, so then I'm just gonna place them in there. Let me get this one. If you wanna see what I'm doing. They are so adorable! So yeah, I'm just trying to fix this. I want to make a little space in there for them. So it looks a little something like this. Sorry. Looks like that from like an overview thing. And then you see them. And then you can make little wheels and everything. So. Yeah, thanks for watching. Um, all the foam, if you want to do it, you can just put it around there to put some color on it. Okay, so yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.